In this video, we'll talk about why you should stop playing Brookhaven RP. Slap that like button and hit subscribe for more Roblox goodies. Let's go! Number 5. Roblox Brookhaven Brookhaven is a role-playing game with a variety of buildings and settings that might be found in a town, including a store, a church, a school, and a playground. Brookhaven is notable for its straightforward gameplay, with no in-game cash and simply Robux as a means of purchasing new things and features. The player can choose from a range of dwellings and cars in Brookhaven. The majority of in-game game products, residences, and cars are free and available to players as soon as they join the game. Number 4. The City Bloxfornia's and Neo Bloxfornia's capital cities are Brookhaven and Robloxia, respectively. The city has a population of 100 million people, making it the largest city in both Bloxfornia and Neo Bloxifornia. The city is close to Bloxburg and Seaboard City, both in Bloxifornia and it is part of Brookhaven County, which is also in Bloxifornia. Bloxifornia's largest city is Brookhaven. There are many jobs, housing, and other amenities in the city. The Brookhaven government is in charge of the city's maintenance and water supply. Brookhaven serves as a transportation hub with an airport, taxi, train, and bus station. Number 3. Why is it bad? Like many other gaming platforms, Roblox Brookhaven includes self-policing features like moderators and regulations. But there are always ways for people with bad intentions to get onto the platform and into your child's chat room, Jordan points out. She cites an example in the United Kingdom in which a mother discovered her kid was being groomed by a predator on the online platform, which resulted in her son receiving inappropriate photographs on a third-party messaging service unrelated to Roblox. Parents Together has also received reports from other members regarding deeply concerning Roblox encounters their children have had, including a 7-year-old in Massachusetts who was contacted by someone begging her to provide photographs because they wanted to be her buddy, according to Nelson. Number 2. What is Roblox doing about it? Roblox responds to concerns by stating that the platform was created with kids and teens in mind from the start, and they are committed to ensuring their safety. We have a responsibility to ensure that our players can learn, create, and play in a safe environment, says Tammy Bahumik, Roblox's VP for Digital Civility. This is our top focus, and that will never change. She goes on to say that the company has a human review team that monitors for safety in multiple languages and keeps an eye out for chat behavior that clearly indicates an attempt to lure a player away from our platform and onto another. Less restrictive third-party chat apps and that filters are even stricter for users under the age of 13, such as blocking all use of numbers and potentially personally identifiable information. The platform also prohibits the transmission of photos or video through chat one-on-one -on -one user interactions. Number 1. The Conclusion Whether or not you're supervising your child on this side, Nelson advocates having direct and open conversations to ensure that your child understands that if they see or experience something online that doesn't seem right to them, they may and should tell you. Having these talks on a regular basis and even checking in occasionally to see what they're up to on the platform, he says, may help you identify any possible difficulties that may arise. When parents follow expert suggestions, Roblox Brookhaven is a safe gaming environment for kids. 
the easiest method to safeguard your children's safety is to make it a rule that they play Roblox Brookhaven in a shared family space where you can supervise their activities. And that wraps up the video for today. That's all for me today. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you guys could hit the like on this video and turn on notification so when I upload next, you guys get notified would mean a lot. Also, if you guys could hit the big red button and subscribe to my channel, it would be great. See you guys in the next video and peace.